Hello, everyone, and welcome to Edge Pro. My name is Patty Warren, and I'm going to be the host for today's video. Today, we're going to be talking about the practice overview that is located in advanced reporting. It's the top one over here on the right hand side. Now, just like many other pages in advanced reporting, it's about diving deeper into our data or a different view or more insight into our data. The practice overview has some of the same information from our business overview overview summary, only we gain more insight. I'm going to kind of show you an example that I have here. I've got the business overview opened in another tab. I'm sorted by quarter three of this year. I can see that we have $26,000 that were up overall. It happens to be 16,000 in the clinic and it's 9,500 over here in the optical. Now, when I go to advanced reporting, practice overview, I actually have the same three boxes located down here at the bottom. Here's my 26,000. I have 16,000 in the clinic. I have 9,500 over here in the optical. But what's different or diving deeper is the graph that I gain right here in the center. We actually have a pie chart. When I hover here to the gray side, I can see that 48% of my revenue comes from my optical. When I hover over the blue pie, I can see that 52% of my revenue comes from my clinic. What this is doing also is we're gaining what makes up my quarter, which is July, August and September. When I hover over July, I'm going to use my clinic as the example. I can see that 48% of my revenue came from the clinic in July of this year. I can see that 53% of my revenue come, came from the clinic in August. In September, I can see that it's 55%. I can see those shifts or see those changes in my revenue over the different months within the quarter. Now, like many other pages in advanced reporting, we do have our filters. That's going to be our purple boxes that we have up here. You can choose a, a particular plan if you would like, and it will filter out, and you can see that data based off of the plan. You can also choose a by doctor. You know, we have these filters located in many places within advanced reporting. So I want to kind of show you a new filter that we have over here, and it's on the right-hand side of the page. The by month is going to control the months within our graph. We can get a different view here if we like. If I wanted to come up here and choose by quarter, I could. Right now, I've only got one quarter. But if I change my date ranges to year to date, now I'm going to gain each quarter of this year. I've got quarter one compared to quarter two, quarter three, quarter four. So you get that different view within the graph here. I can also come up here and choose by day of the week. So if I wanted to see what were my busiest days of the weeks, I could. Let's kind of take a look. I can see that on Sundays, 44% of my revenue comes from the clinic, but 55% of my revenue comes from the optical. Sundays are really good days for the optical. We can see when I hover over Monday, obviously this year we're not open on Mondays like we were last year. Again, that's just another routine or another shift in our business. I can see that on Tuesdays, we have 55% of our revenue coming from the clinic, 45% coming from the optical. So I think you kind of get the idea here on how you can view it by the different days of the week. So I'm going to show you another filter that we have here, and that is going to be by year. Now, when I think of by year, this is where I think of my trends. You know, how am I doing over time? I do have one year just in my date range. I've just got this year. But I can come in here, backspace out the 21. I could put in 2019. Now, hit update, and I can view my data over a three-year time period. And I've still got that graphed. When I hover over 2019, let's just kind of take a look at the clinic for our example. I can see that 48% of my revenue came from the clinic in 2019. In 2020, 49%, I moved up a little. In 2021, I've got 50%. So you can see my trend is that I'm moving upward in my clinic. So again, this page is just more details than what we get 
into our business overview overview summary. Remember, some of that same information, we're just diving deeper. We're getting a different view. We still have our main filters, you know, right here with by plan and by doctor, but we do gain the new filter over here to the right. I hope this was helpful. Everyone have a great day. Thank you.